These uh, go down in underneath the journals, underneath the wheel, one end of the trunk to the other. Uh, they kind of hold, keep the wheels from falling out. The little marks you see there were cracks that the AC electric, the people who um, did the sandblasting and priming on these noticed in, so we will fill those in, weld them up. We just didn't have a chance to do it the other day. Braces for the pilot, the cow cat. It's interesting, one is much larger than the other, and it appears that they must have replaced one at some time or other. I expect, I think, the three of the four that we have are all different. So what you see in front of you here is rod that's sort of been cut to length. And from this, for this car and another one we're going to work on, smaller rods are all going to be used for making bolts. Because they're square head bolts, which we're finding are hard to get, they're also of a, quite a long length. So what we will do is we'll put a nut on one end, weld it on, thread the other end, and uh, make a, a long bolt. These big rods here are the pin for the swing links, which go in the bolsters of the truck. Those will be cut into 18-inch pieces, have a hole for a cotter pin drilled through on each end. So the springs just fit right inside? Yes. Yeah. And there's, there's like a top and a bottom? Yeah, th these are the bottom. Yeah. The top ones, pieces are all right. They look this, almost the same. Okay. okay. What we're in the process of doing is, uh, at this stage, is an awful lot of cleaning up. Much of the material on the car was rusty. And actually, as rusty parts go, these are pretty good. These are some pulleys that go on the truck. That there's a big rod that rests that rides on that, and they're pretty good. We put them in our sandblaster and just blast off all of the uh, the crud. And when you get done and come down to it, what remains is in pretty good shape. And uh, these are spacers that go on the equalizers of the truck. This is something to do that goes in the center of the truck. I, I didn't take it apart, so I don't know exactly what it is. But we have all of these are about to get primed and painted a very nice shiny black because we don't want to have this happen again. On the top of this one, for instance, you can see the amount that has been lost due to rust. And uh, if you, that happens too many times, why there's nothing left. What really goes is the fasteners. There were bolts through the holes here, the bolts were through the holes here, and we have they had just rusted away some of them, so there was almost nothing left. I, I think just force of habit was what was holding 100 together uh, at the end. So anyway, all of these castings are for the trucks, because our object right now is to try to get the trucks back together.